Well, welcome back to Your Travel with Olivia. I'm Olivia and today I am joined with my fellow travelers who are coming with me to South Africa. As you know, we've been doing a series now and this is part four. And what we are doing today is we are going to pack all of this into our suitcase. Well, here, I, today I have Lil who's um, traveling with me as well. She's actually my roommate. And Ruby. then I have my <laughs> sister-in-law here is Shanti. And you have seen Shanti before. She was in a previous video called Be Prepared to Travel. And she was excellent in that video. She is um, what we call Mary Packer because she actually has <laughs> everything. She has one of those endless bags that she has everything in it. And um, she's a great person to travel with, right? Right, Chanty? Yes, fabulous. <laughs> I can't draw my own company. <laughs> so let's get started on um, getting all of this stuff into our suitcase here. Okay, so we did make up a list, um, but I'm sure there'll be other things and items that we can add to what we have already developed here. As well as feel free to jump in at any time and add anything that you think that we've missed and you would definitely have on your trip if you were going to South Africa or any of these other exotic trips. And put that in the comments section down below. We'd love to hear what it is that you pack as well. So first and foremost, what are we gonna put in here? I have my bra and underwear and socks. I put all of those in a bag. Very, very conscious of the fact that I should have my meds because on my last trip I forgot my BP tablets and that was scary. Okay, so, so your medications are? Oh, your meds should not be in your suitcase. Oh, that's no. true too. So, point that out. so, okay, meds never in your suitcase. They no. should be in your carry-on. So here what we have is our suitcase that we plan on checking. And then we also have our carry-on as well. So, um, which is our uh, backpack. I got it. And um, anything that you feel that you can put in there, like your meds. Okay. I'm also going to be um, carrying my camera, of course, to record this whole trip for you guys. <laughs> These are the binoculars that you'll also be carrying with you. Now be sure and check out the previous video that I did, which is a part three of the series. In there, I've got a lot of the equipment that I brought with me um, that was going to go in my backpack with like your camera equipment and that. So please check that out. <laughs> I'll put the card up here somewhere so that you can take a look in that. So I won't be going through all that again. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we want to take um, mm -hmm. a fair amount of t-shirts. So when we say a fair amount, what would probably be a good? I'd say anywhere from six to seven. They don't usually take up that much room. Our trip that we're going on is a combination of stopping off in England for four days and then we're heading on to Cape Town. And then from there, we're going on two game safaris as well as Victoria Falls. So we have a few different areas and temperatures that we have to pack for, and we're gonna be gone for a total of 17 days. So here I've got uh, two dresses that I'm also packing because we plan on having high tea in England. Right, right? Yes, yes. we are. And <coughs> we wanted to, of course, take some capri pants as well as um, I have yoga pants and I have uh, dress pants that can um, also be casual pants as well. Of course, when you're going on the safari, you wanna make sure that you're uh, dressed so that your arms are covered, your legs are covered, and your toes are covered as well. So make sure close. that your shoes are closed toe shoes. So I'm gonna be wearing closed toe shoes. And so those will be coming with me, as well as um, water shoes. I always take water shoes with me, just in case we go in the water, I never go barefoot. So these are always great to have. Don't forget your nighty and shorts and of course something warm. Just one nighty? No, it's not two. <laughs> no, she has several tops but one nighty. <laughs> I think you need two nighties. Just in case you get scared and you pee yourself. Like <laughs> That's been recorded, you know, a bug, remember? A bug comes by. <laughs> You got a lot of stuff in here. Wow. I don't think it's... <laughs> like I said, the one you leave home, one you show in the video and the one you leave home with. <laughs> and there we go. We're all back. <laughs> Ready? What about your shoes? This is hilarious. I haven't even packed my shoes yet. 
And then we <laughs> still have the toiletries. <laughs> wow! So my toiletries, of course, your soap, your toothpaste, and um, etc. I think you need to start your video and then go again. And that's that. <laughs> this is hilarious. <laughs> You know why we did it this way? So that you could see that, you know. It's not gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> that you could see that it's there not easy to pack yeah. for such a long, such a long trip with such Ooh. a small room. But it can be done. Because look, I did it. <laughs> we still have our carry-on. Oh, so the go. main thing with the carry-on, of course, is that you're just packing things that you're allowed to carry on. Carry what about on. your um the mm -hmm. money. The money right Where do you there. carry your money? That's okay. very important. So in regards to your money, you definitely want to make sure that you um, divide this up. So you will have definitely some on you and then you will put some away and you'll put them in various places. Also, don't forget to photocopy your passport, photocopy your credit cards and photocopy your health insurance. Anything like that as well as leave a copy back at home. So Lil, yeah. you were mentioning that, you know, coming on this trip that you really had no idea about packing and what to take with you. So has this really helped you? Yeah, um, you were extremely helpful. I mean, I had no idea how much to take or how little. And I find sometimes when I travel, I carry unnecessary products or whatever. And I was very happy for this. I needed this. <laughs> Um, so Shanti, you have a few items that you have collected and I think that a lot of the items that you've brought to our attention are amazing. So bring it to their attention. <laughs> we'll kill them all in the room. <laughs> <laughs> every, every insect could be two feet away. <laughs> so you've got a fly swatter. Fly swatter. Fly swatter. Oh, very That's good. a must. And then we've got these for your suitcases and so no one can break into them into the hotel. And you wouldn't know about it because that's great. So sir, basically if you if you latch it onto your um, your zipper like that and then once you close it, if anybody was to get into your suitcase, you'd have to open this so now you know someone was in there. So, so how do you all do that? You, you have it. to cut it every you time? You have to cut it. Oh. You have to cut so it. you have to have a, a well, problem. Yeah, that's okay, but that means they, can, they can't put it back together. Like a, yeah. like a but lock. They can jimmy a lock and put it back together. Yeah. yeah, but by the same token, you have to have enough of them to well, be in and out. Well, dollar store. <laughs> <laughs> and we have our night light. Gotta have lights at night. Watch to see the bugs. <laughs> Find your way to the and bathroom. And we have lavender <laughs> to help you to sleep and also keeps the bugs away. This whole trip is about keeping the bugs away. Yeah, it's all bugs. <laughs> That's all I seem to hear a lot of bugs, bugs, bug bugs. Bug-free trip. <laughs> so, I know we're going to a safari, but there should be no bugs. <laughs> Collapsible water bottles. Yeah, they're mm -hmm. very handy. They're very handy. You can put them in the freezer the night before because you have cold water and yeah. you swallow it up when you're done. Those are excellent. Because of a certain age, you need uh, a <laughs> up for your knees. <laughs> you can enjoy your trip. <laughs> for all you silver travelers out there. <laughs> and this this scarf here is actually uh, all the uses. You can rob a bank. <laughs> <laughs> we won't rob a bank. <laughs> it, could be, it could be a neck scarf. It could take from cover the dust or for anything. Yeah. It, it has like six, fun six functions. Wow. That you can put that on. This is neat. Yeah, our cubes. Is. It has a raincoat, a uh, winter coat. Shanti has been here as a guest before, and she did a previous video with us where she did open this up and showed you guys how she packs this winter coat and raincoat in here. So, so here we were able to pack everything in our suitcase and our carry-on. And we are ready for our trip to South Africa. Yay! Yay! See you guys. Really excited about this trip. And so like I said, we will be bringing you guys along with us. Um, definitely we're going to be taping the whole thing. The ups, the downs, and anything else in trouble that we get into. And we'll be hanging over um, Victoria Falls and saying, Hey everybody, here I am! <laughs> We'll see how it compares with Niagara Falls. This is great yeah. because I'm the camera person so I can watch her hangover and I'll <laughs> film it for you guys. So this is all going to work out great. Yes, thank you so much for joining us here today. I hope that you got a lot out of exactly what we've come up with. Don't forget if you have any other items or something else or that you'd want to pass on to other travelers out there, 
please put those in the comment section down below as well as don't forget hey you know what if this is your first time visiting this channel please consider subscribing by hitting the subscribe button down below and the bell to let you know that I have just uploaded a new video. So if this is your week to travel, I wanna wish you a safe trip there as well as a safe return home. Until we see each other again next week, hope the ends. Bye bye. Bye bye. In Afrikaans. Bye. I am joined with my fellow travelers. This is the part three, part four. This is part four. I'm gonna start again. <laughs> <laughs> I see why she has to edit it. Jen.